What's up guys, Shane Starnes here with Droid Modern X. As you guys know, I like to do speed tests on all the new phones as they come out, comparing them to whatever the current flagship device is. This can help push you over the edge or make you back down from buying a new device. Many of you guys have been asking me to do a speed test of a Nexus device with stock Android versus the iPhone 6S. That's what we're gonna do today. As you guys know, the brand new Android 6.0 Marshmallow has begun to roll out to Nexus devices. My Nexus 6 is rocking Marshmallow. We're going to do a speed test, Android 6.0 Marshmallow versus iOS 9 on the iPhone 6S. Let's go ahead and get started. All right guys, Nexus 6 on the left, iPhone 6S on the right. We're gonna start things out just by running some stock applications. Both of these devices should be able to chew through these stock applications. The Nexus 6, mind you, is a device from last year while the iPhone 6S is a brand new device. As you can see, the Nexus 6 from last year is actually keeping up with the iPhone 6S. It is just barely behind and only because it had trouble opening up that camera app. As you guys can see, it took it just a few seconds more than the iPhone 6S but it is surprisingly keeping up with this brand new iPhone 6S. And as you guys can see, they're pretty much keeping the same pace. Now the iPhone is already finished with its first lap at 35 seconds. And here is the test of Android Marshmallow 6.0. How does it manage multitasking? And as you guys can see, it is flying through the second lap. Whereas a device like the Note 5 had incredible trouble with RAM management. Uh, with the Note 5, you actually have to reopen every application here, the applications are already open and ready to use. Multitasking on the Nexus 6 is a whole lot better, but it is still not as good as the iPhone 6S. Now, these were almost identical in their speeds. You guys can see the iPhone 6S finished at 54 seconds. The Nexus 6 on Android 6.0 Marshmallow finished at one minute. And I think the camera was the downfall of the Nexus 6. As you guys can see, it took a few little seconds extra to open up that camera application, but overall, I think the Nexus 6 did an awesome job. We only have about a six second difference, and if that camera hadn't been a little slow to open, I think we would have had a tie, or the Nexus 6 could have actually beat the iPhone 6S. Anyways, guys, that about wraps it up for this video. I hope you've enjoyed this video. If you like this video, be sure to give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe to this channel for more content like this in the future. You can find more of me at droidmoderx.com news.houndandroid.com. Thanks guys for watching. Be blessed. I'll see you in the next one.